Yeah, I mean, I think Taj has uh, adopted the role of assistant general manager for us. So it's uh, it's good when you can uh, have someone like Taj as a resource that's able to vet a lot of these guys. You know, Taj is. Uh, he, he just seems to know everybody, and so uh, when we came across Pat and obviously the relationship they have uh, previously knowing each other and, uh, you know, it's important too with the imports that they have that synergy and chemistry amongst the, each other. We saw that last year, um, so we want to replicate that this year, but, uh, let, you know, they like each other, they challenge each other. The good thing is, is, you know, Taj is someone that needs to be held accountable every now and again and uh, and he's aware of that and uh, and Pat is someone that's able to do that so anything that makes my job a little bit easier uh, I'm all for it. I guess prior to this you had you were adding a lot more youth to the side he adds a lot more experience and then I guess yeah can you just talk me through that and how important that is to to the side? Yeah I mean I, I think I made no secret especially at the start that I wanted a high level uh, guard um, you know and my philosophy has always been the same that, you know, the imports you bring in are to uh, complement the, the the local talent you have around. Um, and so, obviously, the, the theme was length and defence and, uh, and youth and, and um, you know, Pat brings that. He's, he's a tough guard, he's a, an elite defender, um, so he's going to help raise the bar in that category for us. But, yeah, and we can rely on a guy that's played on some big stages and some uh, real clutch moments of the game. Um, so we can look to rely on him to, you know, be able to shoulder that burden and, and, and take on the big moment. You guys having that relationship with Taj, and have they played together before? And if so, do you think that that synergy will be important on court? Yeah, I don't think they played. They, they went to the same college, um, but at different times. Um, you know, they definitely would have, uh, you know, uh, played the casual pickup game. Um, but I don't think they actually played each other professionally, or, or, or some maybe from against each other. But. Uh, you know, look, you know, they're excited for it, and, and as am I. Um, Taj has always been the barometer of, of the energy in this group, um, the work rate, the work ethic. Um, so, you know, having him and Bull and Sam, um, you know, it's really important that anyone we bring in helps elevate that another level, uh, and Pat will do just that. In terms of family, you, know, you brought your family here, and then you're raising a young family, and Patrick's going to do the same. And did you have any influence on, on that when you decided to bring him here? No, I mean, he, he's very much a family man, and that was one thing that he highlighted early on. And I said, you know, Kansas is a great community, and I mean, in terms of nature and scenery and, and parks and wildlife and, and everything else that kids absolutely get into, I don't think you can get a better spot than Cairns, you know. Um, to be, you know, a couple of feet away from a, a six metre crocodile that's just separated by a fence. I don't think you can get that experience anywhere else. I'm still adjusting to it. So it's great that he's going to be here with his family. And, uh, you know, that's important for him. It's important for us. And, and to make that work is uh, really crucial. And final thing is, what's he like from a personality perspective? Tough. Like, he's a killer. And that's what we want. You know, he's... Uh, on the court, we want to be feared, and he's going to add uh, another level of that. Um, but he's the ultimate teammate, you know. He's got a uh, very approachable persona, which our young guys are going to, you know, thrive off, and, and he's going to want to be able to share his knowledge and wisdom of, you know, every every uh, high level league he's played in. So um, it's it's a great balance for us. It's 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 a crucial piece that we needed. Um, I want him to look back on his entire career and, and point out Kansas the best basketball he's ever enjoyed. And so uh, that's going to be my job as well as getting some wins. Actually, one more was uh, he, I think he matched up against Sam a few months ago. We're giving credit to Taj. Does Sam have a role in bringing him here too? No, actually, it was a game I watched, and that's what sort of alerted to us. Um, you know, he's a very similar style of play uh, with some players that have played here in the past. And, um, you know, I think his capability to be. Uh, you know, a top five scorer and uh, an all first team nomination uh, was a standout. So watching his game against Sam and then, you know, having those communications with Taj and the ball just got rolling from there. So, um, yeah, he's, he, he's going to make uh, a real splash in this league. So you just got the one more local spot left. Just talk me through what's, how, how are you going to fix it? Put the piece, the missing pieces of the puzzle together. Sorry, let's go back. Yeah, well, it ended up being a bit of a domino effect. We wanted to make sure, firstly, that we got, um, you know, with, with Taron and, and, and Meninga and, and Bull, uh, who was a free agent, 
we wanted to get those things to fall and then the domino effect next was the next star and that was going to influence what the, the final import spot and the final local spot looked like. Um, you know, Pat, we already we had in that pipeline just because I knew I wanted a, a higher level guard. So I've got everything I want. And the cool thing about it is I don't think uh, that last local spot especially is going to be restricted by position. It's just going to be best fit, whether it's a guard, whether it's a big, whether it's an 18 year old, whether it's a 31 year old, right? Um, you know, the import we're going to take to Summer League, uh, which we fly out next week for, and you know, that's going to be, you know, pretty important, you know, that's a four man and, and another big. Um, but yeah, that last local spot, it's open to anyone. And that's what we're doing right now as assistant coaches. We're watching every NBL one game, we're watching New Zealand League, um, you know, players out there. If you don't think anyone's watching, we are. So um, we want to get the guy that fits our team identity, um, our style of play, but also, you know, brings high energy, high character. That's really important. How is that? How Sam's first week been in Cairns? Amazing. He's a he's a beast. You know, his his work rate is through the roof. Um, I think um, I think we've got a real gem there, and uh, uh, you know, it's going to surprise some people. Uh, I, you know, I know there's a lot of hype for some rookies around the league at the moment, and maybe he falls under the radar because uh, he's New Zealander. But yeah, he's he's absolutely going to grab the bull by the horns and and own it. Yeah, thank you. Thanks. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. not doing anything at Summer League either, just so you know. <laughs> not doing anything.